songwriter from Brooklyn, New York, that won $32,000, five questions away from big, big bucks. Once appeared on uh, Jeopardy, right? Yeah, I did. How'd you do? Uh, I won twice. You won twice? I won twice, yeah. How much money did you win? I won about 20 pounds. And how long were you there? Uh, I was there, uh, they, they take five shows in a day, so, but I was still there for two days. Two days? Yeah. And you won 20,000? Yeah. Peanuts! Yeah. <laughs> Nothing! Here Peanuts you are, 10 time. minutes, and you won 32,000 already. But it's fun, isn't it? It is great. Yeah. All right, so uh, so here we go. We're going back to it. You've got two lifelines, well, two important lifelines. You can phone a friend. We can poll the audience, but we'll play up to $64,000, and let's do it. Let's play. $64,000, David. What is Buddy Lee, the mascot for Lee Dungaree? A monkey puppet, animated cat, Talking dog, little boy dog. I'm almost certain it's a uh, it's a little boy doll. And it's, because it's kind of a three D, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna not use a lifeline. I'm gonna say a, a little boy doll. Little boy doll, make that your uh, final answer. Little boy doll, it is. Questions, two lifelines, tremendous shape, and going for $125,000. What Broadway musical character is known as the Demon Barber of Fleet Street? Pippin, Sweeney Todd, Sky Masterson, Edward Drew. This is one of the best things I ever saw. It's just Sweeney Todd, the final answer. That's who he was, Sweeney Todd, the Demon Barber. Still two lifelines. Oh my gosh. You're going for 250000 And you killed yourself on Jeopardy for two days for 20 <laughs> Ridiculous. Feeling all right? Feeling good. Gary back there seems to be getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> I think he's 6'11 right now. <laughs> okay, here it comes, my man, for $250,000. Take a look. What do sumo wrestlers throw into the ring at the beginning of every wrestling match? Salt? Rice, seawater, flower petals. I think I know. It's not flower petals. And it's not seawater, it's something dry. I think it's salt supposed to purify the drink. So, I don't know if I should use a lifeline now or if I should save it for something that I would well, if you, you, you listen, if you don't use it, you'll have two questions and two lifelines. Yeah, that's true. true. How, how confident are you? I feel like I'm about two-thirds confident. Um, Let's see, you, you discarded flower petals? I discarded flower petals and seawater. Sea I think it's salt. I'm going to say salt. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to just do it. A salt, final answer. Yes, for 250. Purifying ritual. Well, here's where we are. You know, you get the 500,000, and then we're talking about 2,140,000. Yeah. You could go down and buy Nashville for that. <laughs> okay, a half million dollars. What do you think, Jerry? <laughs> Jerry gave you one of these. <laughs> half million dollars. A guy from Brooklyn, New York, to write the country song. Here we go, 500,000. Check it out. Which U.S. state's name is believed to be based on a mythical paradise in a 1510 Spanish novel? Texas, Arizona, Florida, California. I'm pretty sure it's California. I grew up in California. Did you? Yeah. And I'm pretty sure I've read this. So am I sure enough to risk that much money without calling somebody? 
Uh, do you think you, uh, anybody would know this on your telephone? Yeah, that'd be good. Just if you want to double check. Yeah, that's right. I think I'm going to say California, all right? You want to make that your final answer? Yes. You could lose $218,000, but you win a half million!